my beautiful people welcome back to my channel it's lizzie atkins as always thank you for staying with me on my beautiful journey and to my newer viewers who have just clicked on this video i hope you enjoy this video today i will be showing y'all twist style as we Nigerians call it gilly first of all before I go into the video I just want to say I'm wearing the Aikens lashes number 39 head over to our Instagram page and order yours supporting small businesses come on guys show some love order yours there's different styles there's like over 10 10 different styles um, free delivery, postage, and packaging, of course. And trust me, you ain't gonna regret. Cause look at this. Come, come on, take a take a closer look at this. Take a closer. You know you want it. You know you want it. You do. You know, you want it. You want it. Head over to the Instagram and order yours now. So let's get into this video. Um, I'm wearing this cause. My hair is a mess on the left side and I'm tying gilly of course so I need to protect my hair like my like the other video the how to tie a turban you want to split in the middle but this time around you're not doing equally because you're doing the final the twist you're not doing the 50 50 you're going to do the 30 70 instead so I'm gonna head now and split. So that's the middle. This is the 50-50 and my 30-70 would be this. This is my 30-70. So if you really want to see in details how I do this pleat, click on my video on how I tie my turban. It's literally singular I used so no fans. Anyways. So now press it as always get my straight line I do my pleats So what you want to do is fold your plates and bring them. Remember you're holding the other one with your hands. I know this is not the easiest, but in quarantine you have to do what you have to do in it. So, well, not like you're going anywhere. Like so. Also my plates are folded are here. Just gonna bring them out beautifully so they can show I can show them off beautifully. So here they are. Like so those are my pleats. And depending on how much pleats or if you want to call it pleats, if you want to call it steps, you know, it's up to you. Depending on how much you want, you know, you keep going. But to me, this is enough. I'm happy with this and now I start to make my fan so I start to build up my fan like so just watch that I'm going I'm making sure it goes all the way and like so right and then remember because it's a fan it's going to be slanted it's not going to be round Put them over each other equally. It's gonna become a pleated round. That's the bridal, the typical bridal style. But because we want this to be a fan with the twist, and you see that I am stopping my fan halfway here. I'm not going any further than this, where my hand stops here. And this is my fan. And remember to always, you know, press it out, press it out, iron it out. You know, 
whatever you want to call it. We are boom, boom, boom. I bring it over to lock down the fan so it does not move my fan does not move so I use that to lock down my fan so it does not move from place you can see and I place my hand hold it down while I twist so the fan does not twist with me because we don't want a twisted fan do we we want a fan with a twist so I've got my twist so I'm happy with my twist, I'm happy with my fan. Don't worry too much, I'll come, in, come back to ranges. As long as this does not move from its place, everything is still good. You're good to go. Right, now you tie your gilly as always, as usual. So before I finish that off, I'll just come back around to the front, just following, you know, what I've done here. Not doing anything new, just literally following everything I've done here to make it look neat and clean. Let me make that come up like so. If you think you've got too much excess here, you can just come around to the back here and pull. As you see, if you pull, we're getting you're pulling away the excess so just come around here and make this look neat don't style gilly with earrings <laughs> if your earrings on take them off no don't take them off. do your gilly first before you put your earrings on this is what happens this is what will happen if you do your gilly with your earrings on i mean some people can but Clearly, Lizzie cannot because it just came off. Now, I'll show you all how to tie it. So, here we are. And then just tidy up the back, you know, my pin. Voila. Here we are. Let me try. I'm gonna try and give it 360 on this. Ooh. Okay, I'm just gonna move it back a bit because that's what you do once your gillet is done. And ooh, feels good. Actually, that looks beautiful. That actually looks like this looks like auto gilly. I, I swear the pleats I'm sorry I'm just I'm praising myself because this actually looks good this looks good yes self-love I hope you all enjoyed this video I hope it was helpful I hope it was you know heating some points and I hope it was clear enough step by step on how I have done and achieved this look this style is called fan with the twist once again, I'm wearing D.A. Kins lashes at number 39. Head over to the Instagram and order yours now. Slide in there, DM, boom, and order yours. There's 10 different styles to choose from. So, yeah, be sure to order yours. Supporting small businesses, my love. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. And do not forget to hit that notification bell to always get a notification every time I upload new content. Thank you all once again and I will see you.